Alright. We are back. We're gonna find the ghostly ghost. Oh, hello. It's Moven. Hey, thanks. Looks like him. I'm a lot more dead than I was a couple days ago. But I got no idea how or why. I need your help. Ass shot. Kind of name is that? Life. That was my pirate name. And death. That's still my pirate name. But I don't remember nothing else but this year hook in my head. And maybe something about the apothecary. Maybe we can go find some answers there. Let's go. I'm gonna tell you the law. Like I, the dogfish dropped. Yeah. Apothecary, eh? Haven't been down here. Them cannons look like they're attached to the gate mechanism. Oh. You know, pirates are notoriously forgetful. So they usually leave the solution hanging around somewhere. Ah. Has the number on it. Hey, you did it! Let's head into the apothecary. Okay, just making sure those don't die. Why is magic dry? Oh, I gotta see them. Kill them. like rubbish. Died nicely Maybe Melek. I think they fed you to the sea wargs, chum. I hope I was dead before I got in. Look at Larry. The enchanted nosewing protected me from potion fumes. Let's go find the back door to the apothecary. Maybe we can figure out the next piece of my death puzzle. Hey! You're not supposed to be here! I know everyone who's supposed to be here! Did you get him? Yeah, there's something of mine through there. I can feel it. Get those guys who we can find. It seems you can't teach an old salt new tricks. Wait with your hands, you buggers! Where the fuck? Give me a hell. It's a merrier place. Oh, I can just hold it. You see? A drain pipe. Hey, it's a drain pipe. We use that to sneak in. Walked off. Maybe we can melt the gradle. Seems like something I'd have done in another life. And by another life, I mean the one I had before I was ghostified. Search for Melton Drink? You rebelled against the pirate captain, and he. Ah, a potion of acid splash. Hot damn, that's a lucky find. Let's melt that grain. I mean, seriously, what are the chances that the exact thing we needed would be right here? Get in there, 
What the hell? Ooh, die. Lucky die. Got nothing Clues? Oh, what the fuck? Potion cookbook and a mess of seawall pots. Now that's all as I'll get up. It looks like someone was making a big old batch of seawall pots. <laughs> How the hell did I get in there? Maybe I'm not supposed to. Ooh, lucky die. Ooh, 15. Well, my hair feels fake. Says here there's a huge shipment of so called healing potions headed for Brightcourt. Could this be why I was killed? Did I try to stop this? This doesn't look so good. I'm working on a theory. Let's keep moving. <laughs> Wait, I hear you. Listen. This be the last batch we're making for Brightcourt. The strongest one yet. Town's not gonna know what hit him. <laughs> I remember now because of the thing they just said. White Wolf's in danger. How do I die? Answer me. It's rude, Alex. I knew he'd come back for us. Quick, drink the potions. It's our only hope. What the fuck? They turned into dogfish. Why would you want to tone into dogfish? Okay, not a healing potion. Definitely a turn you into a sea ward potion. Crazy, right? I'm so close to something here. Oh, that's my hat. Grab it. Grab what? Oh, the hat. Wow, you're a genius. That turns people into sea wargs. Because of the potion that turns people into sea wargs. Every time you get one of my things back, I remember things. Fury lives in weird stuff where I sense of identity, I guess. But look, we gotta get to the vat for them making this potion and stop them from, you know, doing the it. The vat. Now we gotta do these potions to turn everyone in bright light. That just couldn't let it happen. It's one thing to shake a potion down, but my gosh, it's another thing altogether to turn a whole town into sea walks. <clears throat> hey! You guys suck! How are you all gonna die too? Oh, we got a whelp.
potentially a lot is I took a hook to the head while trying to shut this back down. Too bad you weren't here for that one, huh? Well, I remember how to do it now. Right to temperature on the van. I'm just looking for some dyes again. Oh, I can jump up here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, shit. What? That should wreck the vat for good. So we just need to add something that'll make sure the current batch is ruined. An ingredient straight from the hack realm. Find ingredient X. Well, found it. That's it. Now throw it in the vat and this potion's toast. I rescued him, but really, I fear. What is this terrible ingredient? It's a pirate secret. Although, they didn't shove a hook in my brain, so I guess <sighs> I can tell you. It's fine, Apple. Add to anything, instantly will. Huh. What's it like to be so wrong? Ha <laughs> ha! It's done, Joe. Now we just gotta stop them sending what they already made to Brighton. To the captain's quarters! To the captain's quarters! Ahoy! Tried to turn Brighthoof into Sea Wargoville. I'm in. Hey, I don't want to argue, all right? Let's go. I'm coming for you, Captain Pirate. Watch your ass, you son of a gun. So their yeah. big plan was to turn people into Sea Wargs and then steal from them. <laughs> yes. Wouldn't the Sea Wargs be even more dangerous than the people, though? Well, I mean, yeah, sure, but. What are they gonna do? Mm. Stop you from taking their stuff? Seahorks can't exactly wear nice jewelry. <laughs> Why not? Well, because, because, I don't know, they, they don't have ears? Have you seen them wear jewelry? <laughs> it's in my head, okay? Okay, let's just suspend our disbelief here and help our pirate ghost friend, okay? Okay. What in the name of Drills, Barber? What now? Surprise, Captain. I bet you thought you'd see the last of me. Rude Alex. You failed to stop my plot. Who is Rude Alex? So now you return in death. I should have known you would be that bloody annoying. But the town is mine. You're driving me nuts. Remains for days. <laughs> <laughs> you were short work. More meat for the grinder. God damn, I'm awful. Looky here, a land lover. How's a full up here? Well, that was easy. It was not difficult at all. Oh, he turned into a uh, sword, swordfish, should sword shark. Really did that. Not only did you avenge me, but you saved Brighton. 
Map of world. Oh, back here? I thought I got everyone, every quest in the crack mass cove. Can't wait to barbecue some bar I guess not. Yeah, it's way right over there. I don't get how you get that fucking die. I think she's more than fail. A please wouldn't kill you. <laughs> you were short work. Looks comfy. Now bring it back. Obviously. Now, you're gonna walk my child around and help him do his business. And if you do it wrong, you will suffer. Oh, Pookie, Archie Aker's found a new walker. Such a good boy. Yes, you are. Oh. Now put that collar on. Time for walking. It is me. It can talk. It's kind of cute. Oh, 
Oh my god, Pookie. He didn't go. He does this sometimes. Just follow him. He'll find the right spot soon enough. Ew. Oh, hey, it's Pookie Ken's happy funny ball. He just loves swallowing that thing. Grab it. Wait, adventurer. I have passed through my master's anus 147 times. Please, end me. What's the hold up? Give Pookie his ball back. No, not again. What have I done to deserve this? Take him to the park. Racist son of a bitches. Sea ward people, I swear. Oh, those bullies. Hey, you. There's a little teeny rune on Pookie's collar. Go ahead and hit it for me. Play time, Pookie. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bet you wish you turned away. Inventory is full. Oh my god, there's still another one? Okay, Pookie Muffin. That's enough fun for today. Come on back home now. You heard me bring him home. While they were dying, those Crab Park dudes said something about Pookie being like a legend. What was that about? If you'd read the tie in novel, you'd understand. Yeah, Valentine, I did. What? When? And the leg took you long enough. Now it's feeding time. Turn on his collar again so he can eat like a big boy. Go on, Pookie. Feed. Fucking Pookie, you want some of this shit? You're gonna get it. Some spells. There go, Pookie Bear. Collar's all gone now. Go sleep peace now, okay, boy? Now you take that collar back where you found it, you butt-sniffing frog Well, what do you 
waiting for? A cookie? Get the hell off my property, you malcontent. I am such a rude bitch. Ah, it's up there, so I should go over here. Look at that ship, that looks sick. You're just in time, my dear Lachance. Wind of my heart sail has been captured. It's that thieving pirate lord, Long Bronze Gilbert. I aim to run him through with a rusty cutlass, but alas, he wears the most potent protection, the chances plot armor. After Gilbert Sweet talked his way onto our boat last night, he stole the chance away and vanished. Must have been using that sea sorcery that's so popular here on the island. Go talk with the local witch doctor. We'll have to fight fire with fire. Plot armor, eh? Precious booty. No man can die when wearing it, so the legends go. Somehow, Gilbert pried the armor off my chance. Unless he... No, he had to have used some magic devilry. No, they Which slept together. Old friend. Her magic's helped me out of many a sea pickle. Which oh, is shit. like a sea cucumber, but even brightier. Oh, only a seven. Boy, the witch doctor. Damn sea witches. That be she, but she be asleep. Or in a trance. Or a sleep trance. Find a way to wake her from her witchy slumbers. Get up. Well, blow me down. That trunk's be deeper than a sudden <laughs> semiotation. But have no fear. <laughs> There's a cannon not far that you <laughs> might commandeer. Short of course. <laughs> no. Welcome to Yes We Cannon. Here for all your cannon needs. Why well, do you have a Ready box on your head? Oh, we've got the powder. Uh, care to give it a blast, me lord? Are you having a laugh? Give me something louder. Oh, no. just sorry, shots. The lordy wants it louder. Bring her down below and swap her up with something what kicks proper. 
Let's show them what the Far Mountain Clan can do! Listen to me very closely, because this is important. I need the loudest cannon you have. Hear that? But the dragon cannon is forbidden. Ever since it woke the dragons of the Far Mountain in the last age. Perfect. That's the one. Very well. Dragon cannon... Dragon cannon hoy! Right, you dogs! Raise hoy that elder boar from which all worldly sorrows were shot! Today, we rouse the hells themselves! Holy shit! Put your backs and do it, you sorry spineless axe of sword! Don't get the customer waiting all day! Just a moment more, I'm sure. Pull her up, Buster! The Lord is dying old age up here! I am so sorry, me Lord. Fear you. Cannon. That's ready. Alright. What? Sorry! Just fired a giant cannon! Oh, what's so bloody important that I couldn't get a little shut eye? Need to kill a man in plot armor. You know how to destroy it? Destroy plot armor? Impossible! Unless you're a cunning witch doctor like myself. I can't destroy it per se. But the curse of true character could turn a crusty coward into a smaller creature. And the armor would fall right off. Well, then again, they might transform into a vicious giant monster. Depending on their character. Either or. Well, half of that sounds promising, at least. Tell you what. Meet me at the Ravenous Caverns, and we'll put the curse together. Together! Alright, don't mind if I do. Um, no, something in my eye, and I fell off. Bones. So it's you who wants to destroy some plot armor. Didn't the chance own some? I thought you two were flotsam bound together in a foamy sea of love. Aye, we are now and always will be. But the chance has been kidnapped, and his plot armor sits on the burly chest of Long Bronze Gilbert. I won't rest till my love is in my arms and my blade in Gilbert's See, that's, that's really dumb. The fucking waypoint. If I move past the waypoint, it should update, no? Whoa, what the fuck? He's transformed! Now slay 
slay him and gather his gooey essence. <laughs> the sound effects, though. What happened to the essence? Oh. Oh, I blame you for trying. Who's a good boy? I've never seen an adventurer so skilled at crushing crustaceans. Well done. But to complete the curse, I'll need my cauldron. I'll meet you at the beach near my hut. But beware. Those coiled crones have given more sailors peg leg than the diamond sword dagger scissor Could I theoretically jump off of that? Ah, uh, fuck it. Let's go try it out. No, I can't. I don't think so. Oh, what the fuck am I going? Whoever you are, you handsomely mysterious murderer, you'll be joining the ranks of my undead crew, once we make you dead first, that is. <laughs> crew, attack! Hold out best you can! Old Bones is on his way! <clears throat> Pirates, pirates, pirates. Reminds me of Pirates of the Caribbean with all those pirates. 
not that much of a weapons, but you know. Yes, please. Well, he's cheating on you with uh, Legit Bear, so. Behold, 
A little sage sorcery and the sacrifice of a single innocent soul. Bones! The chance! No! And with that, long bronze Gilbert begins draining the chance's soul energy. Har, har, har. And with your partner's sacrifice, I can summon my loyal crew from beyond death's reach. <laughs> It's not too late. We can still save La Chance. Kill the crew. Hold on. He's reviving his whole crew with just one soul. Part of us all. Keep up, Nelly Mel. Just how much soul energy does La Chance have anyway? I don't know. Enough. He's got like a whole bunch. Okay, just so Pilates. Shut up. You're no match for my loyal crew. I think I'm killing them pretty easy. Time to end this. Let's see if the witch doctor's hex does the trick. Place the caster and fire away. Oh shit. Oh, 
your bones. There's someone here who'd like to see you. Oh, can you hear me, Bo? chance, my love, you're, you're free. Free and waiting for you. You always come for me, Bozzy, and sure is the time. Here you are. Oh, the chance, but I'm a skeleton, and ye be not but ether. We can't truly be together unless, unless. Magey Hughes is some sea sorcery! Me hearty! Hex me! You sure? That last fight was brutal. Sure is sure. Once I'm a fearsome giant crab, I'll pop right out of me plot armor, and then you can unmoor my ghostly spirit from my corporeal bonds! Alright. If you say so. They all look the same. I give up all the nautical debauchery in the world for just one more. The chance. Oh, you're a terrible scoundrel. Yarr, and don't ye forget it, love. As for you, I bequeath to ye me chest of worldly plunder. We won't be needing it where we're going. Tis all yours, be hearty. Now come see us away. It's terrible luck starting a journey without a proper send-off. Right. Uh, thanks for the treasure. Oh, and good luck with your voyage or whatever. But the voyage? <laughs> but where to? We have no chart. I don't need a map to know we're bound for adventure, dearest. Let's get away from all this. <laughs> Away, chance away, we'll go away together. Away, chance away, we'll far away. <laughs> well, that's the beautiful story. That's... Ah, so it's all overworld now. Okay, catch you next time. Peace.